Tonight, the community is remembering that 14 year decorated Army veteran and hometown hero. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. I'm Curtis Fuller. The Lakota West graduate is being honored all over for his service and love of his country. WLWT News 5's Tammy Mutasa is live for us at the school where she spoke with his former coach and friend. Tammy? Curtis, coaches and friends tell me Sergeant First Class Corey Hood was born to serve this country. He went into service right after graduating from Lakota West here in 2001, and there's a memorial starting to grow behind me. He just had that drive, he had that determination. He never forgot where he came from. That was the thing that impressed me more than anything. Sergeant First Class Corey Hood died performing his passion and pride. His Lakota West family left tributes honoring a true hometown hero. And his name's not on the wall, his pictures aren't on the wall, but his determination and grit and toughness that he learned in wrestling, he carried that on. The 32 year old Army Golden Knights parachutist had been doing a stunt in the Chicago Air and Water Show. Investigators say he collided midair with another parachutist and fell. We spoke with his longtime friend Austin Rhodes, who was driving back home from Chicago after his friend's accident. When we heard about the accident, a few of my friends just knew that we had to be there for him because we felt like he, he would have done the same for us. He was always there for us. The Lakota West graduate had been jumping since 2010. He received many awards, including five Army Commendation and five Achievement Medals. Before he became a parachutist, Hood served five tours of duty in Iraq and Afghanistan. His former wrestling coach's fondest memory is a war story Hood told his class on a visit in 2006. And Corey told our team that what kept him going in that foxhole was he kept reminding himself, if I can make it through wrestling practice, I can survive this. He didn't want us to, to know that however long that you're here, just, uh, Now, coaches tell us Hood always enjoyed coming back here and inspiring other kids to be the very best that they can be. Reporting live from Lakota West, Tammy Matassa, WLWT News 5. All right, thanks a lot, Tammy. The Army Golden Knights canceled their performance today. Investigators say the other jumper is a member of the Navy Leapfrogs and was treated for a broken leg.